4,000 feet above where we're standing right now. Oops. This is Turnigan Arm, south of Anchorage. Those mountains are uh, Girdwood at the ski resort. Still snow up on top. It's the middle of July right now. We're down towards the end of Turnigan Arm. Down at the end down there is uh, Portage, Whittier. That's the end of the arm. It's the south side of it over there. We'll be behind them mountains here in a little while when we drive over. And that's uh, west towards Anchorage, northwest. Actually, southwest. Right now, the tide is going out. Second highest tide in the world here, 32 feet, has been known to hit. You can see that the, the arm is dry out there in the middle. It's all silt deposits where the people get stuck and die if they walk out there. To give you an idea how fast the tide goes, there's a little drainage over here where it's going out. I'll try to zoom in and show you. It's like a river. That's the tide moving out, emptying the arm. It's about 35 miles long, this arm will empty in under an hour, completely empty. You see, it looks just like a river going out. When we come back here later today, this will be full. The whole arm will be full of water. It's one of the only places in the world you can see a boar tide. Stand by the water, Dan. What water? Yeah, what water, exactly. It's all out in the ocean now. But this is Turnigan Arm, named after Captain Cook. Came to the end looking for a passage and had to turn again. And that way, like I said, about 30, 35 miles is Cook Inlet and Anchorage.